It's okay. It's a. It, Those weren't knights or soldiers, but fathers and sons. It's necessary. We're part of the moonlight. Ain't no fair to say. Can't win the sunlight. After three, we're still in white clouds though. So. I have to say, it's a real honor to accompany such a brave and distinguished knight, none other than Catherine. Wielder of Thunderbrand. Thunderbrand? What are you talking about? <laughs> Thunderbrand? You mean you don't know? My Ooh! mother is called Thunderbrand. That's cool. It's one of the hero's relics. A long, long time ago, the goddess bestowed divine weapons upon ten heroes, which were passed down to their descendants. It's an honor to wield, but I'm afraid there I won't like be any army. chance for that today. Our mission is to help clean up the aftermath, not to fight. Huh? Why would Lenato incite such a reckless rebellion? We're not fighting? I thought we were fighting. You should know more about that than any of us, Ash. Hmm? Well, I don't. Lenato never mentioned anything of the like to me. Well, he's he hurt. probably didn't want you getting caught up in his own personal vendetta. Is Ash related to Lord Lenato? I'm Lenato's adopted son. Oh! He raised me as though I were his own blood. Oh, this is gonna be tough. He was tough. always so kind. I don't understand. Oh no. I guess it has to do with Kristoff. This is gonna be a touchy family. How much subject. do you know about the tragedy of Dusker, Professor? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. It's when the king of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus was was murdered by the people of Dusker. Oh wait, this it is happened about four uh, years ago. Fuck. It's okay, Catherine. Please, go on. Right. Mm. Well, Lord Lenato's son, Kristoff, was accused of being involved in that whole awful affair. He was executed by the church. But he adopted Ash. Why was the king targeted? Dimitri! <laughs> king Lambert was attempting a major political reform. Needless to say, he had many enemies. Whatever the truth behind that incident may be, Lord Lenato has harbored resentment toward the church ever since. Well, to be more specific, his grudge isn't only against the church. It's also against the one who turned Kristoff over to them. Report! The enemy is approaching. They can't be avoided. Fuck Their okay. numbers are far greater than we predicted. Oh, shit. They use the fog to slip past the knight's perimeter. Uh -oh. It looks like our mission just changed, Professor. Everyone, prepare for battle! Okay, I was gonna say we have to fight. Okay, uh, it's very, this topic is very sensitive. Okay. With this fog, oh shit, I didn't look at the map. It's impossible to tell where the enemy might be. Uh oh. Or how many of them there oh, are. Oh god! Oh shit, where did it come from? The enemy could be trying to surround us, but they shouldn't have enough soldiers to form a tight circle. Take down anyone who breaks through the fog, and let's push through! Oh god, I couldn't see shit. Shouting from within the fog. It seems the knights are already battling. Oh. Proceed with caution. Wait for them to enter your field of view. Okay. Lenato doesn't deserve such sadness and anger. Now it's your turn to suffer. Wow, how rude. Why, Lenato? Why did you drag so many others into this? Ooh! Ferdinand. What can you... I need him on my team right now. <laughs> do we have the help of soldiers over there? think we nothing while you try to kill our lord? <laughs> Ooh! Oh wait, that's me. Congrats me for jogging.
I didn't let him stop. I'm sorry. <laughs> but did you really think you would get away with this? I was hoping those people would be a little bit better. Where do I start? Wow. I mean, she's pulling her weight, but her people are not. Oh, oh there it goes. After I say something. Piloted off if you missed that. Right, Mercedes, uh, the fog's lifting as a result of the dark mage being defeated. It seems the fog has been caused by magic. Oh, let's cut soon. What the fuck is that? Is it an old man? Come out! Oh wait, it's <laughs> oh it's her. I'm so dumb. I thought they were showing me the Lord already. She is OP. Can you be on my team, please? It's you. Oh, you can see the Lord? Thunder he is an old man. It was your wretched celery that killed my son. <laughs> the only name I answer to is Catherine. Prepare to taste the blade of one who serves the goddess. Now you face a knight of Theros! Ooh. Uh oh. Do we have to kill him? Cause isn't he close to Ash? The fog has cleared. There's nothing left to hide you or the filthy central church from the judgment of the goddess. They were hiding me, they were hiding you. to have an ally you i will be the one to kill you no other you have lost all sense of justice you want to fight me so be it i'll send you to meet your goddess i'd appreciate it if these motherfuckers will come closer to me and not me closer to them Run! I need you to run, but he can't run. Oh God! This is bad news. Oh, I don't want him dead. He's gonna die though. He fucking stunned me. The better to. Ingrid, I had one job. Oh, 
Oh no, she didn't do shit. No damage. Fuck. Please fuck. You just gotta wait. Who else has a move? Ash? He can't move either. Oh no, he's gonna kill for it in Ed. Oh no! So shameful. I gotta restart! You're not gonna move up? Okay. I am Lenata. I sympathize oh. with your position. I really Wait. do. I apologize, Your Highness. It is regrettable that we should cross swords like this. I have no wish to kill you, but I'm afraid you have left me no choice. Please, forgive me. Your for Highness, your father. I cannot stop here. For my child, and for the people of It's Fortland. a rough spot because I understand both of their sides of the story. If you will not it's stand just revenge. Aside, then I have no choice but to cut you down. But it could have been avoided if we all sat down and talked. something Allow me to demonstrate. Bye. That vile woman. Christophe, forgive me. Are you on the horse? Or is just the horse is dead? Oh, I should have let Demetri kill him. Would have been more story impactful. Lenato, I I'm so sorry. Well, technically, you know what? It's better for me to do it. Because then that way, Dimitri and Ash would feel guilty about it. I never thought I'd see Lenato meet this fate. It's okay if I did it. It's okay. I did it for both of you. Well done, everyone. Let's gather our troops and go. And no one died after, like, the second try. I think this is my second try. Because I didn't want Ferdinand to die. Because he was not our troop. We just borrowed him. And peace, Dimitri. Congratulations. And I... I want him on our unit, so <laughs> I'm not gonna let him die. Oh, I gotta why, end soon. Why did this happen? Lenato was always such a kind man. Is he really dead? Did I really do that? <laughs> Everyone in the village was so nice to me, and I. You didn't kill him. Killed no, 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 no! I, I did I it. Killed them all. Well, I had to. I know I had to. I know that. But still, I. What does that make me? It's okay, Ash. Please, don't beat yourself up, Ash. We did what had to be done. Yeah. I'm... I'm sorry. I shouldn't be bothering you. Let me hug him! I'm, I'm going to check on the town. I hope my brother and sister are okay. Oh my god. Wait, we have to go with him. That... That was my first time killing civilians, too. Oh my god. Those who I'm sworn to protect. Was it a necessary sacrifice? This is the reality of war. 
Let's just say it was a necessary sacrifice. Let's not be a cool bitch and say it's the reality of war, even though it's honestly the truth. But these guys have actually never killed anyone before of their people, I think. So it was a necessary sacrifice, Are you okay? Insane? It's a it, those weren't knights or soldiers, but fathers and sons. It's necessary. We, we shouldn't have killed them. Dimitri, listen we to me. We should have found another way. Dimitri, we couldn't. We I, couldn't. I'm sorry, but it's not fair for me to blame you for the circumstance. I know that if we hadn't done what we did, even more civilian lives would have been exactly. lost. Exactly. So it was necessary At for the sacrifice. At least my mind understands that, but my heart. It's okay. Professor, those in power, no matter the era, always claim they fight for a just cause. That they take life to protect it. But... Is it truly okay to take any life you please? No. All in service of some implacable just cause? Not really. Lord Lenato didn't take up arms out of a lust for power. He simply believed his cause to be just. Who's to say it wasn't? Maybe we didn't have to cut him down like that. Maybe we could have reached a mutual understanding. I understand. Found a path of peace. I know what you're trying to say. I, I have to believe that. Perhaps the notion sounds laughable to you. No, it's not. Mere lip service to naive ideals. But I can't believe otherwise. Well, he's such a gentle soul. Sorry to intrude. But this incident may be more serious than anticipated. What happened? I found this on Lord Lenato. It's a note that mentions a plan to assassinate Lady Rhea. We can't tell who sent it, so the source is suspect. But the content is too disturbing to ignore. I don't trust Lady Rhea either, because my dad told me not to. We must report this to Lady Rhea right away. I hope that it's nothing. I think this is where, this is like, the even more cause of Dimitri being fucked up five years later. Because maybe Lady Rhea is just I am glad to fucking see our you mind. Returned safely. The goddess is gracious with her what divine protection. What if she's protection. not good? But it was not only her divine protection that shielded you, was it? You are just as skilled as I had hoped. I just, my students deserve the praise? Yeah, just don't praise me. They did most of it. But I feel like maybe Lady Rhea is technically a bad person. She just knows how to manipulate people by her powers and that she's the archbishop and she has this beautiful land. But technically, she's actually the bad guy. But we don't know the full story. No one knows the full story in this monastery. So we just do what we're told. So technically, well, technically, we're still bad, but technically, we just don't know. <laughs> I am not so sure. What do you mean? What do you I mean? Hope some of the students were hesitant about fighting militia. It's their However, first time. We must punish any sinner who may inflict harm upon believers, even if those sinners are civilians. Okay, she I sounds crazy. I pray the students here. learned a valuable lesson about the fate that awaits all who are foolish enough to point their blades towards the heavens. Okay, I'm not religious, so I don't believe it. Our real concern is what stuff. Catherine reported. The secret message that was in Lord Lenato's possession. I... It contained a deplorable plot to target the Archbishop on the day of the Goddess's Rite of Rebirth. The mm -hmm. plan seems unrealistic at best. But a threat is a threat. We must maintain constant vigilance. Okay. To that end, I would like for you and your students to help with security on the day of the ritual. Okay. We won't let her down. We won't let her the students. You can count on us. We won't let her my students. Even if they encounter an enemy whom they cannot best, they should be fine so long as they have you on their side. Okay, they've died many of times. The right of I just rebirth is time. of paramount importance. It is when the Church of Seros and its believers unite to pray for the return of the goddess. The Why? Archbishop and I will be confined to the goddess tower once the ritual begins. But she's not going to come course, back. Of course, the knights will be on high alert as well. But there aren't enough of them to keep watch on every corner of the monastery. You can't bring back the dead? It's far from ideal to be forced to mobilize students. But the gravity of this situation requires that we all bend. To avoid I don't like living here anymore. While there is no need to fear for my safety, I don't care about your safety at this point. We cannot eye to those who would blaspheme so heinously. With any luck, this will all be for naught. Still, be on your guard. 
I feel like if they found out which students hesitated, they would like annihilate them. Like right away. AKA Dimitri and Ash. The goddess's right of rebirth. Well guess what? It's gonna hit me with a story. It's gonna hit me with a story. Guess what? That's gonna be it for today. Cause Tyler gets off at 3 30. Currently 307 right now, so I have to just end it. I actually spent my entire day playing this game. Um, an hour and a half of it was just trying to not lose anyone on the very first mission for whatever. That took me too fucking long. I should have stuck with the casual player, but I'm just going to stick with classic because I don't know how to change it. And if there is a way to change it, I'm not even going to bother to look into that. <laughs> but I'm going to still try to keep all my units alive, even in classic mode. I'm kind of defeating the purpose, even though I said I wanted my units to die to um, story progression. But I'm very attached to the characters. <sighs> I don't know how to feel about the Archbishop. Um, I have a bad feeling about her just because my dad told me to watch after her. And I don't think... But then again, my dad hasn't told me the whole story. He's also keeping me in the dark about the history and everything. And of course, I can go to the library and read about it. But I'm just too damn lazy to do that. So, I, I honestly do think the Archbishop is doing something. Because five years later, these three here, Demetri, Claude, and Edelgard, they do end up fighting one another. And I think I'm also fighting against them. So uh, something along the lines happens. And I think we're just getting into the cusp of the story. Since we, we now find out that um, there are people against the church. And they want to assassinate Lady Rhea. There has to be a reason why they want to assassinate her. So, yeah. Anyway, that's it for today's episode. Thank you guys for watching. Stay beautiful, and I'll see you guys in the next one.